guys, I hope the lighting is okay. I'll try and fix it as much as I can in editing, but I've just tried to film this, filmed the whole clip rambling on about all different things, and I'm basically a shadow <laughs> um, in front of my curtains over there. So hopefully you can see me a bit better this time than what I've just filmed. going to be a cleaning kind of homeware haul um it's going to be in two parts for me but you'll be seeing it in one part and so if i change positions at some point that that's why we basically had to take sand to nursery in a couple hours and then once we've done that we're going to go to the shops and buy a few more things which i want to include so let's get started none of it's particularly amazingly interesting so um yeah you'll just you'll just have to if you enjoy cleaning stuff then you'll enjoy this video um we are in the middle of like purging our house and completely gutting it and changing a bunch of things i won't go into it because i did want to film before and i'm kind of annoyed about the lighting situation anyway yeah so toilet roll just the cheap one at the moment when we run out of that i'm hoping we can go and get some like andrex or something or at least not the value value brand because it's not the nicest on the bottom we've got some kitchen roll just two nice long rolls of it always handy to have around also handy to have around tesco's all-purpose cloth and some Dettol surface cleansing wipes. I will mostly be using these for Ezra's high chair because um, you can just wipe them and throw them away and there's no spreading of any germs or anything like that, which I personally love because somewhere in the past like couple of weeks I've become a little bit of a germaphobe. It's a bit weird. And also a mat massive glutton. I just keep eating the past two days. I don't know what's going on. Um, Anyway, you guys didn't really need to know that. Next thing on the list, honey and chocolate glade scented candle. I am loving scented candles right now and this one smells amazing. Um, also, when we're doing all the cleaning, it's kind of nice to not just smell bleach and cleaning spray and stuff like that. Um, Cause I really don't like the smells of those things. And last but not least, the Vanish Gold Carpet Care. We have got some really, really horrible marks on our stairs. They look hideous. I'm honestly embarrassed to have people come around and see them. Um, but the fact is that they do, so we want to try and improve them a little bit. But we are working towards getting some new carpets. But, you know, we have to have someone come around and measure them, and then order the carpets, and come and install them, and then we've got to pay for all of that stuff. Well, the measuring's free, but you know what I mean. So yeah, trying to make life a little bit less gross with this. In the meantime, also we have a couple of rugs, one of which is light blue and every little mark shows up on it so much. And I've put it through the wash a few times and the marks still don't go. So I'm gonna give this a go. I'll maybe post on Instagram. Make sure you go and follow me on Instagram. The link is in the description. I post on my Insta story all the time. Um, yeah, so that's a, a good place to follow me and I'm usually doing things on the Instagram. The Insta self an old lady. But yeah, I'll try and post a before and after of using this on the carpet, like the rug, um, but not the stairs because that's just embarrassing because it's, it's horrible. Uh, so yeah, that's part one and I'll see you in part two in just a second okay so part two we're back from the shop now and unfortunately i couldn't get the thing that i was trying to get i'm gonna try and order online and see if i can maybe pick it up either this evening or tomorrow um because we really really need them and if i can get them half price or less than half price i'm pretty sure it is then that'll be brilliant but yeah we did get quite a bit um so I'll start with mostly bathroom stuff. Um, we got some little teeth toothpaste from Aquafresh. Um, technically now all the kids are at different stages for like the, they got the milk teeth, the little teeth and the big teeth. Ezra's, uh, Ezra's milk teeth, Sanders 
little teeth and Ellie's big teeth so I got the middle one and they can all use it because like I feel like it's sh it's just a kind of guideline thing I don't think it's strict you know you can't use it if you're like one and it says three that sounds really bad but like you know I know someone who uses adult toothpaste on their baby so um I guess it's just a bit less minty Okay, anyway, yeah, we got two super soft face cloths. Um, apparently they're fade resistant for up to 50 washes. And a hand towel, which we can probably use as a bath towel for Ezra while he's still little. I'm not a massive fan of this colour, but this was 75p instead of £3, so I got that colour. All the other colours were like three pounds so, or I think there was one that was one pound twenty-five, but it wasn't that nice, so I was just like, yeah, of course. Ooh, that was colour. Then I got a what's this called? A bath towel. I was a bit confused because there's bath towels and bath sheets and I really didn't know the difference. But yeah, this one's bigger again. <laughs> and uh, that'll be for the adults to use and this one was three pound down from I think five I was getting everything on offer again you guys probably know how I love, love to buy deals and like I said I was gonna get another one of these I got the volcanic coconut coast it's nice it says coconut water sea minerals and incense um, it smells really nice but it's quite floral so I probably won't use it anywhere that I'm going to be a lot of the time just because I'm not a massive floral scent fan but I really like the coconutty part of it so yeah and it was a pound even though it said a pound but when I scanned it it said five pound and literally all of the other candles were around two pound maybe three pound and some were like a pound fifty like all the glade ones so I was really like surprised like it says limited edition but like that wouldn't put it up like two or three pounds surely um so I asked the guy and like one of the staff till people and he asked some other lady who worked there to check she was like I'm too busy just put it through at the price that they say and I obviously I said I saw it for a pound so he put it through for a pound but one thing I really really like about this I'll get out now one thing I really do like about this candle is the pictures around the outside is like a volcano with like the ocean behind it but it still looks really wintry because of the like the colours are all like blue and white and stuff it does smell quite nice like I do I like the scent it's just a bit florally than I usually go for. Does this have a pretty design on it? Mm, you could sniff this all day. This is pretty, but it's not. It's not as cool as the volcano. And then the only other thing I got isn't really homewares, but I got some colouring pencils because I really want to learn how to do some like drawing this year and obviously colouring is part of drawing. I need to get some pencil pencils as well um, but I figured this would do for now and this one's kind of like a pencil. So yeah that's my haul, thank you guys for watching, make sure you give it a big thumbs up if you like it, comment down below and subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you in the next video and make sure you go and follow me on instagram to see probably some of these products in use <laughs> bye